What the hell? Is, is this a nightmare? It, it has to be. Th this isn't real. There is no way this can be real. Sayori wouldn't do this. Everything was normal up until a few days ago. That's why I can't believe what my eyes are showing me. I suppressed the urge to vomit. Just yesterday, I told Sayori I would be there for her. I told her I know what's best and that everything will be okay. Then why? Why would she do this? How could I be so helpless? What did I do wrong? Turning down her confession. Damn it, bro. Ah. Yo, this game a little sadistic with the choices. Don't ever give me no options like that again, please. Bro, this game is... Rel oh, my gosh. This game is unforgiving, bro. You choose something wrong, you lose somebody. Why is Sayori gotta be the first one to go, bro? This music is actually quite disturbing, too. That has to have been what pushed her over the edge. Her agonized scream still echoes in my ears. Why did I do that to her when she needed me the most? Why was I so selfish? This is my fault. My swarming thoughts keep telling me everything I could have done to prevent this. If I had just spent more time with her, walked her to school, and gave her what I know she wanted out of our relationship, then I could have prevented this. I know I could have prevented this. Screw the literature club. Yeah, man. Yo, my, yo we got to go talk to Monica, bro. Something's up. Something's up. She said that Monica, she was talking to Monica. And she said, maybe Monica was right. It would be better if I dot, dot, dot. What did Monica say to you? Monica. I'm what? Yo, we got to go grab up. Not Monica, bro. Go back to the club, bro. Screw the festival. I just lost my best friend. Someone I grew up with. She's gone forever now. Nothing I do can bring her back. This isn't some game where I can reset and try something different. I had only one chance and I wasn't careful enough. And now I'll carry this guilt with me until I die. Nothing in my life is worth more than hers. But I still couldn't do what she needed from me. And now, I can never take it back. Never. 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 What you mean, end, bro? What? Holy Jesus. What is that? Whoa, 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 what the f- Whoa! Bro, what the f- Yo, look at Sayori! What is this? What is this? Yo, I'm like legit nervous, bro! <laughs> whoa! Yo, we really just lost Sayori, bro! She looks good. Yo, Mon something's up with Monica, bro. Look, cause Monica's image is like it's, it's like glitching over Sayori's. It's like corrupting Sayori's. All right, I'm gonna click on this, but I promise you, I'm ready to swing at the first jump scare, bro. I'm on it. Psych. <laughs> What? Um, yeah, I, I can't read that. I see an annoying girl running toward me from the distance, waving her arms in the air like she's totally oblivious to any attention she might draw to herself. <laughs> Why do I have a sense of deja vu? 
That the girl, girl is my neighbor and Yo, good going friend. On, you know, you okay? My neighbor and good friend since we were children. Yo, what's about to happen right now? You know, the kind of friend you never see yourself making today, but it just kinds of works out because you've known each other for so long. We used to walk to school together on days like this. But starting around high school, she would oversleep more and more frequently. Bro, don't do this to me. But if she's going to chase after me like this, I almost feel better off running away. However, I just sigh and idle in front of the crosswalk and let catch up to me. I'm going to hit this space bar. And when I hit this space bar, something's, somebody is going to pop up. I do not think it's going to be Sayori. I'm going to hit it. What the hell is about to happen? No, oh my gosh. It's an ordinary school day like any other. Mornings are usually the worst. Being surrounded by couples and friend groups walking to school together. Meanwhile, I've always walked to school alone. I always tell myself it's about time I meet some girls or something like that. But I have no motivation to join any clubs. Hold up, hold up, hold up. Y'all not about to just breeze past that. Like that didn't just happen, bro. What happened? Did they just erase Sayori like from my memory just now? It went from me talking about being on Sayori to always walking to school alone now. Hey yo, something's up. Yo, I can't trust the yo literature club. I can't trust them no more, bro. There's always the anime. Nah. Hold up. Hold up. The school day is as ordinary as ever. And it's over before I know it. After I pack my things, I stare blankly at the wall, looking for an ounce of motivation. Clubs. There really aren't any that interest me. Besides, most of them would probably be way too demanding for me to want to deal with. I guess I have no choice but to start with the anime club. Let's get it. Who? Who's who? Who? I'm I'm touchy right now. It's it's a choke on sight situation with me right now. Who is calling me? Who's taking this chance? Who's gambling with their life today? Oh shit, bruh. <laughs> that legit scared me just now. Oh my god. Uh, Monica, we need to talk. How you doing? Oh my goodness, I totally didn't expect to see you here. What? It's been a while, right? What were you talking about? Ayo, we, we might be in trouble, y'all. <laughs> 